100,000 men, who were basically agriculturist laborers, were required to put up this gigantic tomb. Let's assume the ramp was built. Here's another question that comes to mind. How could it reach the top? Was it built straight or in a spiral way? As the ramps were dismantled once the pyramid was completed, there were only fragments of evidence left for the archaeologists to study on. The builder faced a new task when they were positioned to fit the blocks together. Surprisingly, in such a precise build, a large proportion of the internal stones were unfinished. The gaps between them were filled with rubble and gypsum mortar. However, few archaeologists found new evidence that maybe only a limited few may have worked permanently rather than seasonally and that approximately 20,000 men supported by bakers, priests, physicians were enrolled for this massive task. However, with time, more theories have come out. Professor Mark Lenner of Oriental Institute and Semitic Museum said that he and many Egyptians